Okay, here we have a little modification on the outlet valve for the ram pump. Uh, using uh, simply pipes, and on the insides of the pipe, we have a uh, simple plunger. And this whole item can be removed like that. Inside is the plunger that uh, fits fairly snug on the bottom side of the T, but you can push it in there still. Uh, on the top side, put in some little rings and washers, uh, something that ends up fitting fairly well on the top part of the pipe here and will act as a piston when the water accelerates up through the larger pipe fast enough, even though it's going out these holes, if it ends up coming here, it will definitely pull the plunger off the bottom. So the plunger on this one is not automatically triggered by the flow, it's actually triggered by the water as it comes up through the top of this. Uh, one of the benefits of this is it appears to be self-starting on the ram pump and begins the pumping action immediately and doesn't have to be primed. So I'm going to start this. Right now I have about a 15 foot pipe that has approximately a 4 foot to 5 foot head on it and have the outlet pipe just going up a little bit higher just for demonstration. Uh, I will keep the pipe right now uh, probably should let out some of this pressure. You can see that it was at 10 pounds. Okay, it's normalizing at about 4 pounds, which is the pressure that's coming back down through this pipe. So to start this, simply going to turn on the water and allow it to start flowing. The pumping action begins immediately. And we can see here that I'm already at 10 pounds, growing by uh, about a half pound or more per stroke. Uh, coming up now to 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, uh, at 20 pounds, 21 pounds, 22 pounds, and uh, coming up to 23 pounds now. And all of this is simply automatic, and you can see the water as it does come up, it begins to eject. It actually has a double benefit of some of the water that is still within the pipe acts as a weight, and uh, when the cycle is done, it actually helps to force the plunger back down into the pipe. So we have a pretty good pace here. Uh, it appears to be just a little bit faster than one a second, or close to one pump a second. Um, but we're also being able to get now pretty close to 22 pounds of pressure on this side. And this is, I know I have some leaks down in here, I uh, ran out of Teflon. So it's uh, a pretty good. Inside the chamber here, we've put in simply a piece of uh, foam, like a pipe wrap foam, to act as the cushion for the pipe.